which we have poll data out today that has shocked the Democrat Party. It has shocked the Obama media. It has shocked and depressed the Obama White House and the Obama media. Nothing is as it's supposed to be. Now, I have been trying to tell you for the last month that Obama's polling numbers with women are bad. They are in trouble, and that's why all this is going on. It's worse than even I thought. In the New York Times, Obama's approval number is down to 41%. After all of this, that was supposed to launch him to new heights. It is so bad, it is so funny, the drive-by media, for the first time that I can recall, is saying, well, these polls don't matter. They are in utter denial. It's their own poll. And it's not just the New York Times. There is a Washington Post poll that's just as shocking and just as devastating. There is other polling data along with news. A bunch of people are starting to look at the employment numbers and or unemployment numbers the regime is releasing and comparing it to the economic growth numbers. And some people are scratching their heads saying, now, wait a minute. Okay, if if we're producing and creating all of these new jobs, where's the growth? Where's the economic growth? There isn't any economic growth. And so everybody's trying to figure, and I'll help you out. The employment numbers being released are not legit. They're not true. They're not real. They're fabricated. They're they're massaged. I mean, the the, the, the secret lies in the labor force participation rate. This country has lost 2 million jobs plus since Obama was inaugurated. There are 2 million fewer jobs. Now, I don't care how you want to report monthly unemployment applications and to say that they're coming down there. Even with with the reduction, there are still 370,000 people every month applying for unemployment. There are hundreds of thousands more who have given up. Now, listen to a montage of media people yesterday, one week after launching this all-out attack on your host, a sure winner, going to launch Obama the Democrats back to electoral success. What happened? New ABC Washington Post poll shows President Obama's uh, approval reversing. President Obama's disapproval rating now rising to President Obama in a dead heat against Republican challengers. President Obama is in a tie with both Mitt Romney and Rick Santorum. The latest poll, which shows President's approval rating dipping. Very strong disapproval of the president's performance. The president's job approval has fallen from 50 percent last month to an all-time low. Low, now of 41 percent. A new poll has President Obama's approval rating at an all-time low. 50 percent now say they disapprove of the way Mr. Obama is handling his job. 50 percent strongly disapprove. A dubious new high in his presidency. 41 percent approval. One week after they were all doing handstands. One week after they were all celebrating. One week And Obama has hit all-time lows in his approval and all-time highs in his disapproval. 